The Sue Ross Art Center in downtown Kirksville is open to the public amid the coronavirus pandemic. It is currently holding the Missouri Bicentennial Quilt, which is a traveling exhibit featuring a quilt with a square representing every county in the state of Missouri. The quilt will be leaving the Sue Ross Art Center at the end of the week. The gallery currently also holds art like paintings, stained glass, jewelry, and even instruments, some made by local artists and Truman students and professors. Here is President of the Board of the Kirksville Art Association, Linda Treasure, on the happenings of the Sue Ross Art Center. Hi, um, could you tell me just a little bit about um, what the Kirksville Art Association is, where we are in the Sue Ross Art Center, and what your role is around here? Okay, well, I'm president of the, the board. We are a not-for-profit organization. We're a community arts organization, which just means that we bring the arts to the community of Kirksville. Awesome. So you have a gorgeous quilt upstairs. Um, can you tell me a little bit about it? That is the Missouri Bicentennial Quilt, and it was a collaborative effort between the Missouri State Historical Society, the Missouri Star Quilt Company, and the Missouri uh, Quilters, State Quilters Guild. They worked on that quilt uh, for over a year. Each, each county in the state was able to submit a block, and in, and in some cases, more than one block was submitted and then they reviewed the, the block for determining, you know, if what, what it depicted about each county, and then they had to pick one, one block, and then the Missouri Star Quilt Company assembled the quilt, and it has been on tour around the state. It's a traveling exhibit from the Missouri State Historical Society. How long will it be here for people to see? This is its final week. It, it uh, arrived about the 11th of this month and Saturday will be the last day that it'll be on exhibit here and then it will be off to another county. Perfect. Um, what kind of art do you showcase at the C. Ross Art Center? All kinds of art. We currently have what we call the Regional Visions exhibit which has a wide variety of art. We have fiber arts with quilts, we have ceramics, we have woodworking, uh, we have a lot of different kinds of painting, pastels, oils, acrylics, watercolor, just a, a wide variety. And then we have some mosaic, some glass mosaic, and we have one stained glass piece. Uh, one of, I think, one of our more most uh, interesting are we have dulcimers. That's uh, made by a gentleman from Warrensburg. And we're really excited about this exhibit because it includes artists from a wide a wide area. We have people from Kansas City who are showing here. We have uh, Trenton, Princeton, Chillicothe, Warrensburg. Uh, so it's not just immediate Kirksville artists, but it, it's more of a regional artist show. And we had um, a judge who came in and awarded first, second, and third prizes, and then selected several of the pieces for honorable mention. Awesome. How do people get their art into the exhibits? Well, they need to contact us. And then when we have an exhibit for local artists, they, we will contact them. Awesome. Oh, and I do, I do want to add that the Kirksville Division of Tourism sponsored this particular exhibit and also the, uh, donated the prize money for the winners. Perfect. Um, do you have anything else you'd like to add for people to know? We're just really excited to be in our new home at, at the Sue Ross Art Center, and um, we look forward to, you know, bringing more arts to the community and having, you know, people come in and, and see what we have to offer. And, uh, you know, that's our, our mission is to foster, celebrate, and share the arts. So that's what we try to do. Great. Thank you.